Borno State government has said it was necessary to impose indefinite coffee in Mekoda Meduguri to calm the escalating process for security reasons. The Commissioner of Information and Security has stated this as an emergency press briefing with newsmen at the government house in Meduguri. They appealed to residents to remain calm and once peace is restored, the coffee will be lifted, adding that lockdown was uh, avoid uh, recurrence of uh, the recent uh, Akawuri local government IED explosions that killed 16 people. The Information Commissioner, Professor Usman Ta, also debunked claims that nine journalists were arrested, saying they were only informed to abide by the ethics of journalism in their reportage on the protests. He further added that the state government is doing its best to uh, address the sufferings and hardships of the people. As you are aware, this morning some people came out to protest in the street. And uh, on the eve of this protest, uh, the Boko Haram attacked a village called Malari in Konduga local government where 16 people lost their lives and over 20 people were seriously injured and they are receiving treatment at the state specialist hospital Maidukuri. This is exactly what the Borno State government fears. The risk of infiltration of any uh, peaceful democratic protest by our citizens, the risk of infiltration by violent non-state actors is always there and it has already happened. In order to avert any future infiltration by uh, violent non-state actors, the Borno State government has taken a firm decision to impose the curfew. The tr no journalist is arrested, but uh, some journalists spread news that uh, provoked, that triggered the initial protest, and we called them to order. That's what we did. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.